Hey guys, and on today's video, we're going to be updating your iPhone or iPad. So let's get started. You will be looking for your settings. In your settings, right here, you guys can scroll down. It's going to say general. Under general, software update, your second option. Then from here, we can run the update. It's going to be all the way on the bottom. It's going to say upgrade to iOS 17. However, since this is a big update, what we have to do before that, go back. And then at the start, you guys are gonna see your very first option, it's gonna say your name or your device's name. From there, make sure to run that backup. If you have no more space on your iPhone, iPad, and you're having any problems, or you're having any problems, I should say, well, you guys can go ahead and use your computers in order to update and backup as well. So go ahead and plug in your iPhone or iPad to your computer. For example, on Mac, you guys can use Finder, and on PC, iTunes. But if you like to do this straight from your iPhone or iPad, go ahead, tap right here, also available, going to upgrade to iOS 17. This is not the beta, this is the full version of it. And yes, make sure that you have at least three gigs. And what I mean by that, it's not have exactly three gigs or even four gigs of space, at least have five to six gigs of free space. That way there will not be any problems when it comes down to installing this. Tap on download and install down here below. Put in your passcode if he asks you for one. And then you're gonna have to agree on the bottom right hand side. Tap on agree, agree again. And then finally, it's gonna start downloading. After the downloading process is done, it's gonna go ahead and install. You could technically just leave your iPhone or iPad just to be, and make sure you have at least 50% of your battery. And even then, even if you have, let's say 80% of your battery, I would still recommend having your iPhone or iPad hooked up some electricity charging while it's running any big updates. Apart from that, you could just leave it right now just to be, and later on we should see that it's all done with the update. After it's done downloading, it's gonna say preparing update. Then it's gonna restart. So you're gonna see an Apple logo, a loading bar, and afterwards you are pretty much gonna be done. After a bit, you might see the screen or maybe you didn't see it. It's gonna verify the update, it's gonna restart. So as mentioned, you would see an Apple logo, a loading bar, it's gonna restart. Just swipe up and then you're gonna see this, software update complete, click on continue. And then we are all done with all of this. So just continue on. Welcome to iPhone and we can check in settings, go into general, update, and there we go, iOS 17. Anyways, if you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and like, thank you.